Hey guys, welcome back to Crypto Mischiefs. We are talking about a brand new spanking project on Pulse Chain, the place to be, the degenerate center of DeFi crypto, where the gains are bigger than the losses, or should be. That's the way we like it. This is not financial advice. Crypto is high risk, high return. We like high risk because we get high return. <laughs> it can also be high risk, high no return. We know this, right? Um, always do your own research, protect your funds, and don't go in with, into crypto with anything that you need for your daily life. Akuna Matata. So we're talking today about PLS.farm, and we have a pre-sale whitelist position giveaway going for it. Let's check out what's going on. So this is PLS Farm. This, but uh, so just to let you know full transparency, this is made by the same people who made Pulsed Rate, which did multiple Xs and was really good, and Base Rate, which did really well in the first day, but then has failed to peg from there. Uh, so they decided to change up their idea for um, you know a platform. They're a trusted team. They've never been exploited. They've never cheated anyone. And they decided to make more of a yield farm than a tomb fork um, because they're just struggling to keep peg which is fair enough. Tomb forks are hard and they're not working. So pivot, why not? Got to respect pivot. Let's do it. So PLS farm is kind of similar to, to be honest, it looks kind of similar to SparkSwap, um, which did multiple Xs on launch. Uh, but SparkSwap, of course, did have the backing of the entire EMP ecosystem behind them. And that's why the performance was insane on launch, right? Uh, but they have changed up some of the mechanics of especially like the sparkler um, is one thing that they've changed up to have their own twist on it, which is why I'm talking about it, right? I don't like just straight up forking. I like it when people put a little bit of their own character, their own innovation on it, and that's what they've done here. So we're gonna talk about it. And of course, I like to give pre-sale opportunities to our own NFT club, this one here, the S club, the S coin club, right? So by owning our NFTs, you get yourself into our private DAO. You also get airdrops every month. We have an airdrop on November the 15th, which is next week for all NFT holders. If you are in our DAO, that means that you have already seen the whitelist form. Let me check that out. Oh, that's Pulse Trip. I'm just checking up on Pulse Trip because it's awesome. Um, so in our DAO, we have ooh, we're up to about 200 members. We have a bit of a bot problem. We're up to 250. Then, <laughs> if you did get kicked, please rejoin. Um, but we have in the competition room, we have a new competition for the pre-sale for the PLS farm, which is this form here. Please come into the DAO, come into competitions and giveaway, and then you'll be able to uh, get onto the form. The form is here. What do you need to do? Pretty simple. Um, to get on the whitelist, you need to own an NFT. If you own an NFT, you can then put in your wallet address, which holds the NFT, and then your Telegram ID. In one day, I'm gonna give this 24 hours, right? I'm gonna be giving this form, choosing eight winners from this form, and eight winners, we have over 500 NFT holders, right? Many more, actually, 588, actually, last time I checked, so I need to update the website. Um, but you need to just put in the wallet that holds the NFT, your Telegram ID, eight of you are gonna win. We're gonna randomly from our randomized contract picker thing, we're gonna pick eight winners and you guys are gonna get into the whitelist draw for this. Of course, the benefits always of getting into whitelist are that you're gonna get the best price because as everyone else is buying, you already have your tokens. So then you can decide you wanna sell them or you wanna go into farming with them, do whatever you want with them. Uh, I'll tell you as well that the Eternal Engine will have a position in this presale and I will have a position in this presale. I'm gonna go in with the max amount of money for both because I know that this team is trustworthy and trustworthy money is always the best thing in DeFi, right? The other eight positions, you can go in with whatever you feel like. We're gonna have a look at that in more detail very soon. So PLS Farm, what is it? You now know how to get in. This is how you get in. You must have an NFT and you must be, uh, you know, putting into the farm. Also, if you have NFTs, say if you have multiple NFTs, consider putting them on uh, multiple wallets and then entering into this farm with multiple wallets, meaning that you have more chances to win, right? And you might even win on multiple wallets and get multiple pre-sale positions, which you can then maybe give away to a friend or, you know, organize a group of your mates to go in together, these kind of things. All about community. Trees, treat this as a community project and then we will all, all profit. That's how we profit from yield farming. Not from being selfish, we need to be community players. So PLS Farm, it's time to dive into some farmyard fun and start earning those impressive yields on Pulse Chain. You can join the pre-sale here if you are an NFT holder, or you can read the docs here. Um, I know there are also some other competitions going from other YouTubers, so why not just get into all of them, right, and then fill up your position. The telegram for PLS Farm is in the description. I also suggest you join that so you can find out more about the project. Ooh, that's nice. Zoop. 
find the, the white paper here. Okay, so PLS Farm. PLS Farm Steins is an innovative yield farming protocol within the Pulse Chain ecosystem, offering a variety of uh, farming opportunities, single asset staking pools, casino games, and even an in-house bridge for your convenience. Dive into the future of yield farming with us today. So the thing that uh, puts this apart from SparkSwap is that the PLS Farm is going to have a tax system on the uh, reward token, and they're also going to have a casino <clears throat> dApps on board with their UI, which will then, I guess, buy back and burn the reward token. Okay, So that's the big differences that they seem to have made to the system. Our native token is called Cowtip, and the ticker is also Cowtip. Tip those cows. I'm from the countryside. I did a bit of Cowtip in my day. Um, in terms of transactions, there's a 1% tax on both buys and sells. And 100% of, of the taxes goes directly to our single staking reward pool. Okay, So tax on the token given out to people who stake singly to get rewarded. Rewards come in the form of cow tip token for the farms and pools. You can you have the option to sell cow tip directly or engage in single staking by depositing your cow tip into the yield barn to earn LP tokens <coughs> of cow tip and LP, paid from protocol fees and rehypothecation rewards and taxes. Bonus percentages grow exponentially as you extend the length of your lock period up to the max of burn. So this is similar to Sparkler on SparkSwap, where you would take your Spark token and then it would give you back the LP of Spark and Pulse token. The longer that you lock your Spark in there, then the more you get paid out. Utilize your Kauta PLS to enter to either compound your earnings by returning them to the farms or break them to cash out into Kaupit, Kautip and PLS. Um, additionally, there are other farms and single asset pools for you to explore. Um, so that's the essentials of how it all works. Uh, I think the best way for us to go about this is to wait for, you know, launch and then we'll do another, uh, you know, tutorial on how to use the yield farm. Uh, I prefer doing as opposed to reading, right? But they also have casino games, so they'll have coin flip, dice, roulette, and more to come. We're thrilled to introduce our range of entertaining and engaging games designed to provide you with profitability and enjoyment in addition to the thrill of gameplay. We are committed to sharing the profits from these games with our single stakers, creating a win-win scenario for all. So again, the tax on Cowtip token, 1% tax, will go to single asset staking, rewarding people who are holding the Cowtip token instead of selling it. And also the casino games will also be going to people who are single asset staking Cowtip token. So nice little addition to give more utility to the uh, reward token, because that's what we always need, because it's going to be emitted at quite a high tick. This farm, when it launches, because it looks similar to like, you know, Goose Fork style, the APR on this at the beginning, the first days are going to melt your face off. And that's why we're talking about it. And that's why we're getting pre-sale positions, because we want to make those big APRs at the launch of the project. It's going to be much hyped. You're going to see a lot on this. So again, get yourself the NFT, get into the DAO, get into yourself into the whitelist, and try to win those tokens. Peace. I've been Crypto Mischief. Talk to you soon. Do not get wrecked.